it's time to design and produce a custom PCB that recreates the same wiring in clean, optimized layout. To set up everything, I began by preparing the breadboard. For the control unit, I choose an ESP32, which acts as the brain of the project and has enough power to manage all sensors and components. To power the microcontroller and the rest of the electronics, I use a 12V DC power adapter together with step-down module to safely convert the voltage to 5V for the entire system. I added a diode between the 5V step-down output and the ESP32 5V pin. When the LED turns on, the transistor reacts, allowing the signal to pass while keeping both voltages completely isolated. The three servos are powered directly from the 5V output, while the signal wires are connected to separate control pins on the microcontroller. The temperature sensor are powered directly from the ESP32 3V pin, and they share the same ground as the rest of the system, 